Hello? Hi. I'll try it again. Okay, here we are at Chess Stars, and welcome to today's contest. Good luck, everybody. Yes. And here we have, um, we're looking to get Chess Stars president, Sasha Starr, and also uh, we're looking to get Coach Mike. Respondents Master Michael Hofer, welcome. <laughs> Hi, Marty. <laughs> well. <laughs> Any well, we got what we expected. To bring, any dogs to bark? Any uh, helicopters to land? Let's get some noise on this line. Yeah, 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 baby. Well, I hope we don't see another Skaven again today because uh, Quesada has just been uh, having like a, a free lunch with that lately. Oh, good. Yuri, Yuri did. Hey, well, I don't know. He still could go back to it. But uh, yeah, he is varied. I was hopeful Yuri would do that today. D4 coming, though. Uh, well, everybody's tied already. Yeah. Well, <laughs> when will that change? I don't know, but in the words of Doris Day, Uniski no. looks good to me. <laughs> Not in the words of Doris Day. <laughs> All right. It'll be interesting to see which way Yuri goes. Yeah. Marty, well, like, say so. something, dude. I think we know what's happening here. Yeah, we know what's happening here. Yeah. Yeah. The leaderboard nice is starting, to, starting to settle down just a little bit. But look at this, Slavko Popovich. Oh, my God. Already. A thousand crowns Wait, somehow. Wait, that happen? Well, he had 86, right? Wow. I don't know. He must have had every move. Oh, now Yuri's killing me. Thanks, Yuri. All right, then. All right. Oh. Mm. Mm -hmm -hmm. Wow. All right. Yeah, I should have done that. Whatever. And, uh, what is he going to play? Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yuri is the master of uh, transposition. Got to admire him for that. Good job, Yuri. Oh, A6, yeah? Oh, I didn't play Knight of 6. No, he played D6. D6. Whatever. Shows what I know. Too many options. Yeah, yeah. Oh, am I out of bullets yet? No. Well, let's see. No. I'm going to wait until I find out what I got in my database on Yuniski. Ah, boy. And then D6. Okay. All right. And we're on move six. Good times. All right. And let's see if we got Yuniski. Oh, I do. Oh, and I blacked it out. Come on, Mike. We got some Uniski games. There's a chance. I'm saying there's a chance. Oh, I'm, I'm, I put my, my stake at 100 and made a random move. I'm not sure I'm doing the, doing this the best I can. Oh, okay, it's Bishop E3 for sure. I didn't put that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, well. So you're saying there's a chance, Marty. I'm saying there's no chance. <laughs> Uh, now that we know he's going to play bishop e3, and he didn't. G4 now! Whoa! Whoa! Uh-oh. Did you lose me? Uh, hello. Wow. Let's try this again. Marty, have you ever done this before? <laughs> Never. <laughs> wow. It's one of those days. It's called learn by doing, yeah? Yeah, and now A6, and we got the same damn position again. You know, isn't that something? Well, you know, it had to happen. Yeah, well, and I, that's not good for Yuri, in my opinion. In my opinion. You think G4 is a uh, wrong, huh? Well, I think Yuri's in trouble. You think Yuri's in trouble? Yeah. All right, it's very possible. What's a good move here? There's a B3! What else? Oh, there it is! Yeah. Well, there you go. Yep, yep, yep. Whatever, whatever. Jeez. Wow. Yeah, and that is the main line, and Yuniski's not done this before. Interesting. What do you know? I, I wait a minute. I, I'm missing a move now. Oh, jeez. I'm dazed and confused. Oh my god. 
Oh, I left out G4. Yeah, smart guy. So, G4. Stop, 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 chest base. G4. You just have Milojevic. Now it's leading. Okay. All right. Everybody got something that makes sense. How did that happen? H, H6. And he went Bishop D7. All right, then. Dusan Milojevic won 2,000 crowns for, on G4. He was the one who predicted, predicted G4. That's how he got his tax yeah. crowns. Look at that. What? We're out of book? Dusan Milojevic alone picked G4 and won 2,000 plus crowns Bravo, on Dusan. that one move. Bravo, now H4. Man, this game is going crazy already. Boom, 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 boom. What if Black plays something like Queen C7? We're out of book. We're out of book. Unbelievable. We're out of book. Bottom no, bottom, bottom H6 bottom. and B5 have been played here. Really? Well, he's yeah. going to play H6 then. H6 and white won in 1995. B5 and black won in 1996. <laughs> well, did I lose my internet then? What's going on here? Let me go to my hard disk. This is not cool. I'm going to put queen. Oh, oh my B5. God. There well, it is. Bravo, Yuri. For, um, he had to be unpredictable yeah. today. And good wow. job with that. I don't know if it's good. I don't know if it's any good, but um, unpredictable. I like and that. And notice how the engine favors oh. white with a three. In the only published game in this line, black did win, but it doesn't mean white didn't have an advantage and screw it up. That's off. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Not unusual. What the? It's not unusual. Tom Jones, baby. <laughs> 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 you should know better than to do that around me, Marty. <laughs> well, H5 or D5? Knight takes D4. No, nah, he ain't going to do that. He's going to play H5 yeah, or D5. I don't think so either. Who would do that? Knight E7, H5. You think D5? D5 is interesting. He's going to go H5. Yeah, D5, yeah. I kind of, yeah, he's going to go H5. H5. Give me the whole pool for a change. H6. I put H6. I've been wrong on every move so far. Yeah, well, I, yeah, um, I started out really good. And you now, I'm almost good bankrupt. information. You know, don't no, try I am. H6. I'm minus 195. But Dushin, 2180. Slavko, 1132. Nava. I, Nava. I have negative 160 crowns so far. Beat the Mongol. Hey, can I see what the the uh, uh, South America is saying in English now? No, Absolutely. Well, it was uh, not on my screen. What have I got set wrong? No, yeah, you got it. It's saying Team Hispano, Hector and Victor. That's English? Maybe it is. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> that thing. was that was considered English. Okay, cool. Yes, that, I, was, I get, that was. I'm easily confused. Yeah. No, I got Victor, Saludos, Lorena, Gracias. Oh, and, oh, it says both. Oh, you got it both ways. Oh, I see now. Marty, you're smart. Good job, Marty. Yeah. Well, you're, you're not taking the credit for the English? News at 11. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, I don't care what other people say about you. I still think you're smart. <laughs> yeah, yeah, 97. Yeah, really? <laughs> yeah. Um. Oh, no wonder. I'm stupid. No wonder. 97. I thought so, but uh, I didn't put it. I got the wrong <laughs> position in my database, so that's why I'm not getting the games, because I got the, okay, I got the sure. F6. F4 for sure. So, why? Why not? Why anything else? Seriously, Mike. Seriously, Mike. Oh, my God. Yeah, I got the wrong position on the board. That's great, Mike. i just start over. All right, then. Oh, my yeah. Give it up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can remember positions, dude. I do this for a living. Oh, what move number are we on? Oh, geez, I got a bunch more. Oh, yeah, Bishop E3. All right, all right, move 30 on? I can't believe it. Okay, I mean, so we can put G5. that there. G5. Yes, drama. So, G5. Oh, wow, wow. Look at all those pounds. Dude, where am I? It's crowns the war here. Yeah. And Dusimovic is still in the lead. Oh, what move did I leave Sokovic. off? Sokovic. But 
Oh, A3. I didn't Logan know is way out in front. Okay, Vasukov, yeah, and then, so now we're out of book, right? And by the way, today is the birthday of our friend Bob Marin. Yeah. So let's all wish well, Bob Marin. No, it was birthday. yesterday. Okay, no, then yesterday. Yeah. It's Max Weiss's birthday today. <laughs> <laughs> Depends on which time zone you're dealing with. In some time zones, it's today. Okay. Hey, you said <laughs> atomic clock, so I'm not going to argue with you. I might be wrong. You know, I don't want to argue with Marty Hirsch. So there is a, a new effort to attempt to do an experiment in which an atomic clock <laughs> oh is put into a quantum superposition and runs at two speeds at the same time. That You know, I can't tell you how excited I am about that. <laughs> <laughs> I knew you would be thrilled beyond words. Yeah, that's like Dan Fleetwood and flicker noise. I don't know what flicker noise is. And I just told Dan about how I cheered the team on at the lacrosse game. And he says, well, Michael, I can't condone that as a former empire, uh, umpire. And it's like, this guy, want, he's like better than me at everything. It's... Uh, both of you guys, man. Mm. You go to sporting events to cheer, man. Stop, right? Yeah. Thank you. Hey, I got to move right. And queen takes, for sure. Hey, whoa, I, whoa, I can put 25 crowns on this now. Yay. Yeah, and we're following Vasukov uh, Megaramov. Yeah, baby. We got this now. Wow. <laughs> All right. Good times. Well, nice C6. Pick up sticks, right? Bang. Why is Yuri yeah. thinking? Yuri. Really? There we go. Enjoy the show. Where's the queen going to go? It's going to go to D2. And he's going to play line him up Joe. And I like white here. All right. This was Palma de Mallorca, 1989. Hey, I used to be good in 1989. That's when I got the qualification to the World Championship of First Round Stress. I had the argument with Bob Marin yesterday. He was trying to qualify how good I was. When I told him my accomplishments, he said, well, you used the computer. I said, dude, it was 1989. Marty Hugger were computers in 1989. Well, not as good as they are today. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Not even close. Right. So don't even start. Jeez. Oh, Queen A5. Bad. Good Pretty job. bad compared to today. Who At least we were talking about personal computers. What year did and you the best, win? The best computer in the world back then. Munich. That's not even that good either. <laughs> yeah, Munich Mephisto. Like almost 2200. Almost. Am I right? Munich. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, Munich. that was a... Yeah, well, you know, I mean, they... They made beautiful boards. Yeah. Oh, yeah. my God. I paid $1,000 for that thing, but I didn't rely on it. No. Now, when did you win your title? Well, I won several titles. No, no, the World Championship. World, World, World Microcomputer chess. chess Championship in 1995. All right. Yeah, that's when Pro. you were getting to be good. Right. Exactly right. And bravo for that. I was already yeah, it, was on, it was on. It was on. You know, a pretty crappy PC. But you know, I mean, that's the way it was back then. Okay, what's wrong with H five here? I shouldn't have even said anything. I love H five here. Wow. Yes, I love H five here. I mean, wow. Black's king is not going to be safe on if he castles king's side, and white's king doesn't. I guess white can castle king's side, but he doesn't probably want to. Why can just why doesn't white just play like bishop to e2, king f1, king g2? I don't know. Hey Marty, can we go back in time to last week when um, Stockfish said it was a draw and Coach Mike said it's a win? 
and you told me I was wrong, but then it turned out, you know, wow, I was right. Do you remember that? I do. I, I have do. to remember that because it's like my golden moment in my life. I think H5 does the same thing here. I could be wrong, but I love H5 here. I think it wins. Does cool. anybody agree with me? Do we have any title players in the audience? Let's see. Let me look at the spyglass. Orkin, what do you what do you think about H five, Orky? Let us know what you like, and you can put it in the chat. Either everyone or viewers. Oh, okay. Hey, hey. What? Oh, that's right. Half of them can't understand me. What do you guys <laughs> like here? What do you guys think of H five? If you do type and check out the viewers, they can understand. Yeah, I know. It's, it's about time somebody understands me. You know, wow. I'm trying to get somebody to understand this me will, for This years. will be a, a first. <laughs> <laughs> I know, exactly. You know, it almost Brilliant. seems like Lexi Dim understands Brilliant. me, which is amazing. I know you understand me by now, but look how long it took you, Marty. Que pensez-vous de gar de H5? Wow. Roshan's talking to me when I'm on the air. Really? Oh, by the way, Roshan is making a comeback now. I got to tell that guy to shut up. Sorry about that, Perfect. Marty. Oh. Huh. I can't even find it. Dude, I'm on the air. Hey, Roshu, Dude. I am on the air. Go away, Roshan. Yeah, go away, Roshan. Stop. All right, now I'm back, Marty. Good. Yeah, back in black. Like Johnny Cash. I knew you weren't going anywhere. I knew you'd be white black. Yeah. What yeah. is he thinking? There's, you know, that enhances the chances of H5 here. Because he's thinking? Why yeah. do you know he's thinking? Maybe he's sleeping. Yeah, or smoking. Maybe he's dozing. Maybe he's daydreaming. <laughs> thinking, what is that? Oh my God, Russian, he had to answer, yeah. If I go to a pond to H5, what is Black going to do then? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. right, Uniski, H5 H win, mi amigo. Win, We know win it, you can do that. And you know, the wins. more I look at it, the more I think you're right. Thank you. Thank you. That's high <laughs> praise, seriously. I mean, where, where's what? Where, it, it, it leaves the Black King homeless on Bush Boulevard in a cardboard box and it's raining. I think we should change the name of this thing. Instead of choose your moves and win, from now on it's going to be called push your pawns and win. Yeah, that's what's been going on lately. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yes. Yeah, Gadir, B4. It's like, and then Stockfish is like, that doesn't win. Uh, Stockfish. Dude, it's like a, a pawn ending. What's wrong with you? Yeah, that's exactly right. Like, like B4 came as a big surprise. It sometimes does take the engine a little longer to solve some of this stuff. You'd think it'd be, you know, it wouldn't take that long, but it does sometimes take it a minute. Two minutes to really find the right answer. Yeah. Yeah. If you give it a little while, though, it will it will solve these. You see, you and I are in very similar realms where we were doing stuff that uh, everybody looked at us as, uh, wow, those guys are just a little bit strange. They devote a lot of time to chess. A little bit strange. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Who are you talking about? <laughs> well, don't dare call me a little bit. Strange. Let me know when we can post that picture on here, man. I love that picture of you from uh, Circa, uh, you know when. <laughs> you were so, so suave, dude. So cool. Like Rico you, Suave. Oh, my God, yes. You should have been an album cover. Ah, Victor <laughs> Mago, agree with me. And, of course, Uniski turns his bishop into a big pawn. What is and he doing? Remus. What the hell is that? Oh. Come on, man. Unbelievable. Yeah, <laughs> seriously. Let me make my bishop a big part. I'm going to, no. It's no more, no more. Uh, Uniski looks good to me. Not now. Okay, Yuri is now, I think, has a chance to be better. And how's he going to do it? Stockfish says B4. Um, what are the ramifications? What is going on here, man? Oh, my God. I'm beyond dumb. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Mm-hmm. Okay. 
so Bishop is a big pawn. He's got to play b4 here, right, Marty? Of course. Yeah. yeah what else is yeah. this? It's got to. It's the time. It's the only time. Now is the it's time. time. You can't wait. Can't touch this. Hammer time. Break it down. You know, yeah. I want to learn how to do that. You hammer can't dance. wait because why to play king e2 and then it's on. And then it's then you can't play b4. Yeah. 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 Uniski has screwed up here. Edgar Rebus. I've seen that name before. Edgar Rebus is in the lead. It's yeah. unbelievable. He just won 2,345 yeah. crowns in one move. I want a drug and test. He, so he was negative. Notice his score. Yeah. He won 2,345, and now he has 2,308. So he went from negative to first place yeah. in one move. Yeah. Well, Lexi's telling me I can't take Sudafed anymore. Because they, they, they drug test for that, and that's a performance-enhancing drug, according to FIDE. So if I'm going to play in bled, I can't take Sudafed. I want a drug test on this guy, Marty. I think he's taking Sudafed, brother. That's how he found that. Right? Rebus, Rebus, yeah. pop up Sudafeds. Yeah, yeah, stop with the Sudafed, Rebus. <laughs> <laughs> there's, two, there's two versions of Sudafed. Now, there's a, uh, a behind-the-counter, the and there's an yeah, uh, out-in-front. That, that one doesn't So count. you might want to check if that one does not count. Are, are prohibited or if maybe only one Dude. formulation. Is, one might, might be allowed. I, I, I really don't know. But in Florida, they, uh, they make I a sign for it, and then they keep track of you like you're making yeah. crystal meth. Yeah, so that's one. So yeah. that that's actually that's a good one. Pedrin, that's the one that the works. One is, uh, yeah, that, there's that's another, what Edgar uh, Rebus is taking. <laughs> uh, yeah. And then the other the other decongestant's pretty effective too, and it might be okay. It so. never did a damn thing for me. I hate it. You know, it doesn't work for you? No, no, no. I gotta have, uh, to have the real thing, man. I'm hardcore. Uh -huh. <laughs> and, and I think I think Yuri needs some Sudafed now. Why hasn't he moved yet? This is this is a no brainer, Yuri. Hey, did you see the picture I put on Facebook of Yuri in the uh, skin diving outfit? And I, and I said, I wonder if Yuri's going to take a dive today. <laughs> I don't think he liked it. That's clever. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't like that either. <laughs> yeah. yeah, but Yuri is like a man's man. The guy's always doing cool stuff. And it's like, it's good to be solo. So uh, he's got a sense of humor, too. You could try something like Flonase. That's, I'm sure that would be okay. Okay. All right. Well, thank you. Thank you, Dr. Hirsch. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> This guy's eating like scorpions on, on YouTube too, uh, solo. But he's afraid eating to play scorpions. Before. Yeah, well, that's the, my son. He 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 they're tries cooked. everything. He's he's eating scorpion. Yeah, <laughs> but but you're afraid. And now Stockfish says you have to prepare before. Really, really Stockfish, really Stockfish. You're a little bit cautious there, Stockfish. Kick the guy in the head now. Before, come on, solo. Oh my God! And Solo used to play correspondence chess, so it's he like, should know. He should. I mean, come on. This is like right. No, That's no. the correspondence attitude. When a guy does something uh, a little bit hinky like that and turns his bishop into a big pawn, it's time to drop the hammer. And I will also say, Fabiano Carana is winning not from preparation; it's from his confidence. It's it, it, it's like it glows. It makes the opponent scared. You have to slam the pawn on before here. Just was smile, yeah. <sighs> what is hey, he doing? You know, you know, you know who Fabiano's playing today? No, Zviad Azoria. Oh yeah, uh, yeah. I've, I've, I love Azoria, but he's too adventurous. He enjoys chess too much, and that's why he's getting his ass kicked at the U.S. Championship right now. I mean, it's just he's a great guy, uh, and he's, he's he's fun, but man. These guys that play all the Adams and eat, there's more possible chess games than Adams in the foreseeable universe. So they're like that's that's even Chuck's problem. Yeah, you can't prepare for a guy like that, but they also can't learn all these openings because the human brain can only hold so much. So Carolina played a Joe Copiano. Wow. Yeah. Uh, with uh, D three. With D three. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. now he's got the pawn at D five. Uh, no really? of it exchange. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. How the heck did he manage that one? Step by step? <laughs> yeah, I guess. Yeah, I, you know, if chess comes down to Joko's and D3, 
uh, I'd rather give up. You know, if if, if the Rui Lopez. Well, they were discussing this on the video. Thank you, Solo. What were you saying um, about videos? Yeah. You said something about a video. Yeah, we have video broadcast oh, yeah. today and for the rest of the month, every day. We have live video broadcast in both English and Spanish, except there's one rest day. That's outstanding. I think it might be Tuesday. That's outstanding. Yeah. 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 It's, it's a pretty interesting tournament. Oh, yeah. And you got to love the girls. And you got to love our near and dear to us, Anna Zhatansky. And Daniel, he, can you imagine Daniel in the room while he watches the roller coaster rides? One of the players in this <laughs> U.S. championship just turned 15. Oh, yeah. Uh, just Gordy? turned 15. Gordy? Oh, the ones that went carving people up? Yeah. Yeah, she's frightening, man. She's very good. No, one of the men. Oh. A wonder laying, I think. Oh, a wonder. A wonder's going to be world champion. And, and boy. You know, I admire the guy. I've watched him for years because my players have hung out with him because they've been involved in the big things together. Wonders better, right? Hey, I got D5 right. Um, but the dude, he's Chinese and he's from Wisconsin. When I grew up in Wisconsin, <laughs> the only Chinese people own the restaurant. And chess in Wisconsin, come on. If I'd have had chess back then, no telling how good I'd be. So I wonder Liang has everything I never had in Wisconsin. So go Badgers. I'm proud of him. He's been playing really well, and he's a, he's a cool kid. He's actually done quite well yeah. so far. Yeah, and, and did you watch his interview? The guy's got a good head on his shoulders. He's very cool, calm, and realistic. Amazingly realistic. That was good. Yeah. And when, I, when he was a little bit younger, I thought maybe he's a little bit too goofy. But... Uh, the thing is, I always saw a wonder always enjoyed things. Then you got Adi Patel, who was the top Indian, same age. That was just like winning everything in sight, but you could watch him at the board. He was so intense. He'd slam pieces. Um, and he had these mannerisms. And I'm thinking, that guy's going to end up in a nut house. He's just too much uh -oh. pressure on him. But a wonder yeah. enjoys the game. And that was always my problem. I always put self imposed pressure. But it's really important. You can tell. Fabi and I wonder are enjoying themselves right now. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I got to learn how to relax. And maybe somebody can. Carolina has ha always had a fantastic attitude. Oh, and look at and what. I think, I think your point is very well taken. Yes, thank you. Exactly. I've been doing this a while. Yeah. Yeah, and look at Naka right now. Naka's a basket case. He can't win a game. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> it's nerves, man. It's nerves. Yeah, 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 yeah. And you know, oh, geez, I don't know how much we can talk about here, but it's very pretty well known that Fabi had a distraction in his life, and it seems like he doesn't do that anymore. You know, staying out late, kind of having too much fun, uh, and that's really hard to overcome. And if he has any chance against Magnus, he can't be doing that. It's quite it obvious. Is, it is hard to overcome. Yeah. <laughs> I, I agree. <laughs> so this is like my favorite guy right now. I'm cheering for him. You know, mad props, brother. Okay. I think Solo might take the queen. Maybe. I think the match, Carlson and Carolina, is pretty much of a pick -em. Well, yeah, there's not so much juice for Magnus anymore, and and Fabi just doesn't know not to be confident. I think I think he has a shot. I don't think you know. I don't think he is a strong favorite, right? But I think Carolina is a slight favorite, in my opinion. Yeah, yeah. Well, you know what? I can speak from years of experience that I'm a better, much better man for the mistakes I made and recovery. You know, when you've lost everything and then you're in recovery, you look at life differently. And uh, yes, I think that's what's happened to Fabi. I don't, I don't, it's probably going to make a great story when it comes out. Because obviously he's uh, got people supporting him and uh, he is a much better man today. His interviews, too. Another guy, very level headed, very sincere, calm. and very realistic. So important to be calm. Who's not allowed to compete in the contest? Me? <laughs> Jesus Garcia, who are you talking about? 
Hmm. Okay, and then he puts question marks like, okay, whatever, he's who? Oh, jeez. Oh, hey, we, a little drama today. Like we didn't have enough issues. Cool. Let's get it all over within one day. Knight f4, or bishop f4. Good question. Inquiring minds want to know. Uh, he was he was restricted from events because of the suspicion of of computer assistance. So, but it's been a while, so I just re-enabled him. So I told him he can he can he can now enter. Computer assistance and blitz. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Wow, so you keep them out of contest, too. Wow. Yeah. That's yeah. good. You know, give them some consequences. I'm tired yeah. of the cheaters. I'm tired of the liars. I'm tired of the <laughs> fake friends. You know, whatever. So I really expected to win today. Look at me. Yeah, 190. <laughs> minus 10. <laughs> I'm improved. I'm up to minus 74. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, we thought there might be a predictable game today, but no. And, and bravo to these guys. I have no idea who's winning right now. I don't think anybody is. I think it's pretty even. I think it's even. Okay. I got that one right. But, hey. but you know what? It's even, but it's not dry. It's really unfair. Right, right, right. Totally screwed up pawns. Total Extremely imbalance. screwed up. Yeah. I mean, it, the, the last thing you would expect. Out of this position is a draw. Absolutely, my friend. Yeah. That's the great Marty Hirsch, world microcomputer champion, who knows about <laughs> this stuff. Yep. Hey, I'm riding with you, Marty. Yeah. I love you, brother. I respect you. Because you yeah, have no other choice. <laughs> I respect everything you do, even like when you madly screw up today. <laughs> like I've never screwed up. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I gave all my students homework to look at the uh, Jim Valvano speech on the ESPYs where, you know, he was saying, you know, every day smile, every day laugh, every day think, uh, every day cry. And then, um, you know, uh, the, the, the guy in the background said, you have 30 seconds. And Jim Valvano <laughs> says, oh, la, para, la. you got a lot of guts there, man. You know, I got tumors all over my body. You told me I got like, I care about what you are saying in the back that I got 30 seconds. Yeah, that, that cracked me up. But the parents loved it that I gave that as homework. Because we don't just teach chess. We try to make better people. And chess is great for that. Why is Stockfish want him to take the night down? Yeah, I know. There's something. There would have to be something beyond our horizon effect. But he ain't going <laughs> to do that. He's going to play Knight F4, Rookie 1. And probably Knight F4 because the Rookie Well, wait a minute. How does the king ever live anywhere? Whoa. Well, but does it matter what order he does? Does it matter if he moves the knight or the rook first? I hate this. I always get this wrong when you need ski. Ah, uh, okay. I'm going to go with the knight. Knight of, Especially since Stockfish doesn't like it now. Knight of four. And I finally have 100 crowns to wager with. I mean, not wager. We're not betting here. There's gambling. Gambling going on here. I'm shocked. No, um... Yeah, knight f4. It's not on the board. I like it. What say you, Marty? I don't know. <laughs> it's going to be rookie one because I picked knight f4. Almost guaranteed. Yeah. Almost you can That makes sense, actually. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I think rookie one, f1 is the right move. And of course you do. You guys always got to prove you're better than me. You and Dan Fleetwood. Like, you haven't had enough accomplishments. You still got to, like, show me up. Yep, I know what you guys are up to. <laughs> like, you, like, you spend your nights sure. worrying about whether you're better than me. You guys are, how do you accomplish so much? And uh, the world doesn't know. Marty Hirsch is also an excellent dancer. Um, and you do something with music. What, are you, what would you call that? Um, not, are you a composer? What is that? Yes. Yeah, you're a composer. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, dude, you're awesome. Thank you. Bad props. I think so, too. <laughs> I hope your wife thinks so. I hope your wife thinks so. That's what's important. Then now the secret's out. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, Except you know, I Mar Marty, I'm right on this one. I'm right on this one because he would have moved already. I still think Rook FE1 is the best move. 
Well, yeah, at some point you got to x-ray this king in and say where you're going to live, brother. Yeah! You ain't got no crib. You got to put the root on the file of the king, especially when there are no pawns there. Why is Hector <laughs> telling people how to win? Hector, shut up. <laughs> I mean, it's like an elementary heuristic of your, your software program, chess program. It's called Rook King Tropism. <laughs> what a great word. Wow, yeah. Uh, oh, well, really? Uh, you give me an engine, Marty. After all that. Let's have some drama. Really, you give up What I don't understand is if you're going to play a move like that, when would a Hispanic do that? <laughs> Fisher didn't do that. Uh, Capa didn't do Capa Blanca. He didn't like doing that. What do you, what, you know, oh, my God. But engines, I mean, engines love that. Now, now Black is almost looking better. Yeah. I, I hate that move. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, look at Yuri's white squared bishop now. It can breathe. It's raking the board. Film at 11. <laughs> oh, my God. That didn't work. That was like, I, I don't know. I'm going to abstain on this one because it's, it's either rookie one or knight f4, right? Oh, I guess he could go knight c3 since I don't see what plan he has. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. Uh... I think, I think now you got to play knight c3. There's a point where he's going to put a rook on d1, too. Because when there's an open yeah. file, Grandmasters always grab it. But then I can't even figure out which rook. No. Well, he just defined yeah, it. was a rook. Yep. Five winners. They got paid on that, man. Wow. 2,300 crowns. Five winners. Yeah. Wow. Good, good job, guys. That's impressive. Good job. Good job. Good job. Yikes. Dushin Milojevic, 25.97. Edgar Rivas on steroids and, and, and Sudafed, 20, 24.06. Slavko Popovich, uh, Milan's dad, 17.85. The great Matsi Leon, 17.26. The great Nava Star, 8.97. I don't see Sasha's name anywhere. Jose Marquez, 8.59. Irina Barchuk, who always wins when Yuri's playing, 7.93. And Rafael Corrado, 727. Because she understands Yuri's style. And Yuri's got a fan club because he's a cool guy. Well, Bishop E7 is box. He's not he's not gonna go queenside, is he? No. Well, you can't go either way here, really. Jeez. Yeah, we're Yuri, how are you? oh my god, this is a very, very double edged position. And Orkin's being quiet today. Yeah, I think Zach can just play Bishop E7 and Castle King side. Right. The points don't matter anymore. Oh, yeah, the queens are off. Right. Yeah, good point. Hmm. Hmm. Things are making It's, e it's even, and it's looking more dry now the pawns are symmetrical. Uh, here. But black does have the two bishops, and it's a pretty ga gaping open position. So he might be able to. <laughs> if, if, <laughs> if black were Fabiano Carolina. <laughs> Did I understand what you just said, right? Did you say it's a gay open position? Oh, gaping. Uh, gaping. Absolutely. Gaping. Those people Gay is never position. No. <laughs> gaping open position. <laughs> All right. Thank you for uh, contributing, Orkin. I always love your opinions here. And it's like only you and uh, Mago have opinions today. Pinata? Where's the pinata? I don't see anything to punch on. What does that even mean? What are you talking about? Where's their pinata? Okay, guys. Okay. It appears that the, the word pinata, even with the accent over the N, is an English word as well as a Spanish word. Okay. Donde. I didn't, think, I didn't know the English oh. language included oh, that and with the it's symbol not. over it, but now, now we know. <laughs> okay. Now I'm typing this in Spanish. Oh boy. So will that like screw up everything? <laughs> you know, when you, <laughs> when, you type, when you type stupid Spanish, it's. Stupid. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, that's a good point. <laughs> you got your wish. <laughs> yeah, there we go. And now I screwed yeah. up the screen, too. Okay, well, we're doing a recording here. We're trying to be professionals. 
What happened to Sasha, man? I think, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay. Nava wants the one. Well, Nava doesn't want to do the dishes, so she's tied him up with duct tape. Yeah. Yeah, that's what it <laughs> in is. In a chair. <laughs> <laughs> Upside down. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> His feet are tied to the top of the chair. <laughs> hey, it did translate. It says, where is Pinata? But I accidentally typed it in, and Yuri went queenside, <laughs> naked in public in front of everyone. That's why I said stupid Spanish, like, new Pinata. Yeah, what is yeah. that? Yeah, the translator is going, who is this guy? Yeah, I'm embracing <laughs> that I'm a fallible human being, Marty. Okay. Castle's queenside. I, it's huh. okay. It took me years of therapy, Marty, to accept that I'm a fallible human being. And then guys like you and Dan Fleetwood. Yeah, Mike, you, you put an end in there, Mike. <laughs> We're called the anti-therapy. Yeah. <laughs> and now nobody picked this apparently yeah. bad move, Night yeah. G3, really bad move, blunder of a move. Really? And for that reason, yeah, because... Stockfish was saying Rook EB1 and White had, had a starting to build an advantage. Oh. And now after Knight G3, Black may, no, well, no, no. it's still pretty close. Yeah, it's Bishop A4 because uh, now uh, a Rook has to passively defend the C-Pun. And that's just, yeah. You know, oh, I guess it's not that big of a deal. But those Bishops no. still could come into play. Wait a minute. What, what is, is there a tactic here? Yeah, I don't think so. Oh, yeah, there is. He can't yeah. push that C-Pun if he plays Bishop A4. Aha. Hmm. Hmm. Well, this is really complicated, though. Well, for a simple-looking position. But I think Yuri's winning. Uh, not winning, but Yuri has an edge, I think. I think Black's better. Sakura says, I don't know. I just let me put zero, zero, zero. I don't know. Well, these simple-looking positions are, like, where... It really makes a difference between potsers and masters, grandmasters and supermasters. I mean, this is where Karpov, Kotov, I mean, they reign supreme. Korchnoi, they kill in this position. Even Kasparov kills in these kind of positions. Yeah. At least when, oh, yeah. his, when they were at their prime. Well, like Caruana, especially. Especially right? Karpov. Oh, this is a super Karpov position. For ah, black. I got 573 crowns, and I told everyone. Booyah. I didn't want a few. Booyah. Okay. And so does Stockfish. What's wrong with people? Wow. And he, I don't think Twelve he winners. C3, but he Twelve won. winners. The thing is, the pool was enormous. This dude is going to play C3. Okay. Never mind. I didn't say anything I think out he can play C3 or rookie I didn't two say or... anything out loud. Knight F1? Really? He's going to play C3 and it's a bad move. Why does Stockfish recommend Knight F1? Yeah, well, because it's so consistent with Knight G3. <laughs> well, not, not only that, but why, okay. Why, yeah. why Rook A2? That's horrible, yeah. too. I mean, if you're going to move a Rook, what's wrong with Rook E2? I, I, I would, yeah. I mean, dude. But maybe the problem with Rook E2 is Black plays like C3? Yeah, let's tie down our A Rook to two pawns. That's not a good idea. As a correspondence player, I know this. Because I'd rather lose a finger than I don't finger. understand knight f1. What happens after knight f1, bishop c2? It's counting squares, Marty. You should know this. No, no, no. What about counting bonds? Oh, oh, good point. Yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. I'm sorry. That went right over my head. And he did. Ah, yes, yes, I told everyone. I feel like the great Kadir Hussainov. Dude, where am I on the board? Ha, 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 ha. There's hope. Yeah, without hope, there's nothing but despair. Oh, I, I like myself right now. Yes, I do. All right, now if we can figure out what Black's going to do. H6? H6, H6 takes, takes. What is going on? Why Why Stockfish? I don't know. I, I, I. You know, another thing about this kind of position is it's one in which the, um, the computers will suggest a lot of different moves. And there are not going to be moves that that humans might necessarily jump to. Julian, you know? Julian, Julian, why are you here? Julian cost me twenty six hundred crowns, right? 
Yeah. Oh, I hate you, Jillian. I don't even know who you are. Why did you come here today? <laughs> no, he cost you 1,300 crowns. Oh, my God! You would have had his crowns. Ah! Ah, <laughs> oh, jeez. I should just 1,345. Why am I whining about something I can't control? It's something I tell everybody's coaching. And also, in coaching, you use the word potser, Marty. And I try to tell my guys that really no, 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 doesn't no. matter. I am a potser, Michael. Rating doesn't matter, <laughs> and I'll tell you why. I went to a, a tournament in Kissimmee in an orange grove. That's over by Disney World. But this was like in an orange grove with, like, farmers there. And I walk up, and there's Dmitry Gurevich. I'm thinking, what the hell is he doing here, right? <laughs> so I walk up to him. I said, Dmitry, what are you doing here? He said, well, my girlfriend wanted to go to Disney World. I said, well, you're going to make 500 bucks while she's going to Disney World. I said, what's it like to be able to go anywhere in the U.S., any weekend you want, know you're going to make 500 bucks. And he said, it's pretty cool, but I suck internationally. And I'm thinking, like, nobody in chess is happy with their performance. I almost put that in, but I chickened out, so I gave, I gave Slavko and Abdullah. Yeah, but you, you know what? That's actually a really good thing. <laughs> yeah, just, I know. It, Nobody's satisfied except the world champion and, I guess, Fabiano Caruana right now. I don't think, I don't think even they're satisfied, and it's, they're right not to be. Yeah, so chess is just a sport for uh, you know people that. Hey, it's like it's like Federer. I mean, he's never satisfied. Oh, oh, Federer! What a guy! What a guy! Yeah, yeah. You got to be hungry, and I don't know that Magnus is hungry anymore. I don't know. I have no idea what we'll do here. This is Can't channel my inner Doris Day here. Night F one. Really, that ain't happening. Uh, no. Stockfish, what? Not in the Stockfish likes Night F1 twice. Really? Really? Well, then it's got to be Night E4. Yeah, in fact, where is that knight going? Where did Uniski plan on that guy going? Yeah. Yeah, Night E4. That's what he's going to do. Film at 11. I'm going Night E4. The rest of you guys can pick anything. Pick, go with Stockfish, guys. Go Serbia. I love Serbia. Yeah, yeah, Slavko. And go Azerbaijan with Orki. And but there's Serbians in the front, followed by Edgar Rebus on on Sudafed. Matsu Leon is always hanging around. My new enemy Julian. Nava is still in the hunt. And Rafael Carraro. Hmm. Where are you, Marty? <laughs> I'm in California. Yeah, yeah, yeah I didn't think you were in Michigan. Surprise! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, Marty, I can tell you've been really relaxed uh, lately since they've legalized marijuana. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Chill out. <laughs> oh, I do have a funny story about that because people do turn to me on recovery issues, and I'm not going to mention names, but uh, a, a chess friend called me at 5 in the morning asking for help with her alcohol problem. And I, 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 got, I got through. I got through. And then I get this thing, wow, I haven't had a drink in two weeks. And, and I love, they've got liquid uh, cannabis now. A cannabis drink. Really? And, and yeah, and I'm going like, uh, uh, you didn't solve your problem. <laughs> God. And you know what? Yeah, they really? have dry <laughs> alcohol. Yeah. <laughs> powdered alcohol now yeah, as a yeah, seriously. I don't know if it's available to the public yet, and I think there's been a debate about whether or not it should it could be made legal. But it is I in would the Northwest, and it is in uh, British Columbia. It's a, it's available in uh, Canada, huh? Yeah, you can go buy it at a convenience store. How so convenient? now you got a bunch of people losing their ambition and, and eating a lot of uh, Doritos. <laughs> I want two bags of Doritos and a pound of powdered alcohol, please. Yeah, yeah, isn't that something? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. How things change when you live long enough. And 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 a, and a pack of pre rolls. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! This is funny. This whole game, this whole day has been funny. I'm learning how to enjoy life and to not try to control things and just relax and enjoy the ride. 
And then it's a lot more fun and it's funnier too. You figured that out a long time ago though. I know you did. Well, you had to work it for NASA, right? How did you deal is, with the stress at NASA, Marty? Oh, it was a great place to work. Okay, but what's your vice, Marty? What do you do when you're stressed? <laughs> I run. <laughs> run? Yeah. No, no, no. Are you, you run, too? You're like a jogger? Yeah. Oh, my God. You're one of those perfect people. <sighs> okay, why aren't you president yet? Okay, we kind of need one. I'm president of my family. Yeah, that's an, awful, that's an important job, too. Wow. I wonder what's going on in the mind. We're supposed to be exploring the mind. I, I say every week on Facebook, we're exploring the mind of Grand Masters. So we're supposed to be exploring Uniski's mind right now. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. I got like a whole magnifying glass yeah. in each hand. and yeah. like. I thought like, that's what the spyglass was for. Yeah. him into his head, you know. Yeah. Kind of coming in through the fourth dimension, so I can, you know, zoom in on the different sections of his brain. You know? oh, that would be cool, man. Oh my god! Do I actually have a chance yet? Yes, I do. Yeah, because there's gonna be a whole bunch of goofy moves coming up. This could be a lottery. Hmm. <laughs> what do you mean, good thing? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, all right. I think you you're, you're right. A lot of goofy moves are coming on. I think there's no way out of it. No way out. It's a trap. No way out. There's no way out. I love your music taste too, Marty. Yeah. You know, <laughs> if you were a chick, I'd marry you, man. You know what Art Drucker used to say? If my aunt had a ball, she'd be my uncle. <laughs> and you so got me... Oh, man. You got me so loving Brian Ferry again. Oh, my God. What a guy. And he's he has so a good voice. I, he has a good voice. I don't like all of his music. I like a lot of it. I don't like... I like the mellow ones. I don't like his kind of attempt to be more punk. Oh, yeah, yeah. But yeah. Love is a Drug rocks, man. Come on. You agree with me, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Of course. And the eye patch. Oh, yeah. A lot of it is cool. Okay. Is Uniski going to push past? I didn't get that. Oh, he did. I was chicken. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Orky had it, of course. See, Orkin, when Orkin beats me, it's because he's faster than me. That's my one giant flaw. Yeah. Uh, now, is it good... Or, uh, um, it's almost better to be test. fast at this in this in this contest than to be right. Okay, Solo's gonna grab that. He's not pushing past Solo. Take it, take it, Solo. I'll yes, take it. yes, I get a whole 115 crowns. Yay! I'm a genius. No, what's happening? Yeah, now it's exactly. Rook A B one. Really? Rookie six. What's really? Wrong rookie six. What's wrong, rookie six? He's gonna play rookie six. Boom. I'm down on this one, and I'm and, and, and I didn't waste time. Yes, yes. Did Orkin have that? No, oh, we don't know. Yes, we do. Twelve winners. Orkin, you can figure yeah. It out. Orkin put very little on that. Ha ha. Yeah, Orkin. Yeah. Ha ha. I put a hundred on it. Ha. Ha, Orky. Oh, well, they're speeding yeah. up. Yeah. And then I was talking, and I didn't put it right in sight. Okay, yeah. Double trouble. Double trouble coming up. Yeah, he's not dropping. He's not playing the E-Rook back to E-1. Come on. Stop push. Yeah. Rook E-E-1. Yeah. I try to tell you, Marty, these guys can't. I don't care what you say. They can't plan, Marty. They just count. You're right. That's what uh, they do. Finally, you admitted it. Yeah. Yeah, they don't have these mystical powers that they see. Although they there, well, there is me. a way, they there is a way to do planning, <laughs> but these these ones aren't really doing it. No, they're not. Bishop D7 sure looks logical. Yeah. I wish I could here. come up with a cool move. G5 is kind of weird, but uh, I think he'll, he'll drop the bishop back. I think so. Slavko in the lead. I like Slavko. You know why I like Slavko? Because he's, he's, he's an old guy. Not real old, but I mean, yeah. Uh, Matsi. Matsi's a, a guy that's been around for a while. Orkin's a young guy. Nava has immense experience. 
And I don't know what the heck Edgar Rivas is. And, uh, except that he takes Sudafed. <laughs> Julian. Yeah. Hey, Julian. I got I'm 400 crowns ahead of you, Julian. Uh, well, yeah. I'm going to have to take some chances to have a chance. Now, Slavko, is he used to being in the lead? No. Dushin. Dushin is in a... Dushin's in the catbird seat right now. He's used to being in this position, and he knows yeah. how to handle it. Yeah. Edgar, I hate to be the one to tell you you're out of gas, man, because you're, you're, you're sandwiched between Dushin and Matsi, so I wouldn't want to be you. <laughs> yeah. That's me. And what the heck is Yuri thinking about? Uh, the clock know. is even. Interesting. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Do I have any students here today? I guess since Yuri's thinking, I got time to look. Oh, no, they're all in St. Pete playing. I forgot. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, my guys are actually earning their way today. Mm. Yeah, where's Nanad? Nanad! Hey, Nanad, where are you, brother? <laughs> so far as Vienna Zuri is holding on against against uh, Carolina. You're multitasking? Mm. Wow. No. <laughs> Not you. <laughs> Never. <laughs> Marty, I'd like you to do something for me. <laughs> my, my mama taught me, told me never to multitask. <laughs> well, Marty, you know, Marty, when we hired you at Chess Stars, we expect you to do many things. <laughs> and you have. Seriously. Dude, you created the coolest contest on the planet. Thank you. Yeah. And you make it better almost every week with something new. I try. Yeah. Doesn't always work out. <laughs> you know, we'll, we'll knock off the cannabis drink and you'll get a lot more done, man. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You threw me for such a loop when you told me Bob Barron was in New York. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know, Marty. That had me wondering. But, no, you're on top of your game today. I can see it. <sighs> you're making really good comments about this position. That, uh, who's better? Who's better here, Marty? Black is better. What did he just do that for? Does that make sense? Uh-oh. Wait a minute. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know either. I would use the bishop. But maybe... What is it? Whoa, whoa, whoa. What is going on here? Well, yeah. I was looking Are at Rookie 8. Rookie 8 is a problem. Neat. That was dumb. That was dumb, Yuri. Rookie 8 in a heartbeat. Oh, and I didn't get it in. Damn! But everybody had it. Yeah. What is Yuri thinking? You didn't see that? How's he going to develop now? Yuri. Now what? Yuri, what, what you got for us, Yuri? How do you oh, oh, my God! Oh, my God! Oh, my God! Yes, that's it! Rook D4? Yes! And he, oh, really? But, no. Oh. Okay. All right, so, Yuri, yeah, you made a mistake, Yuri. Unless you play Rook takes D4 there. You just screwed up, man. But, you know, can White get something out of this? Well, it's going to be Rook A8. Yeah. You think so? Oh, yeah. And, yeah. Yeah. I think I got it in on time this time. Yeah, I barely did because of the mouse slip, but I got it in. Now, he's got another shot to play yeah. Rook takes D4, but uh, yeah. he's almost got to play a, a, a respective move only like uh, Oh, he can play. Oh, yeah. oh King B7, because Bishop B5 sucks. So, um, oh, he is going to play King B7. All right. Yeah. If he's not in, into Rook D4, he's going to Oh, him. now he does it. Oh, oh my God, it. Yuri, you fool us all. Yes, the great Yuri Solodovnichenko. Great move. I didn't think he was going to do since he didn't do it the first time. And I bet Yuniski takes that. Hmm. Wow. Wow. Oh, who got that? Nine winners. That means people are prisoners of Stockfish. Yeah. <laughs> Stockfish yeah. takes no prisoners. Yeah, because they weren't thinking. Because if you're thinking, if he was going to do that, he should have done it the first time. Unless he's just trying to screw everybody in the contest. Yeah. <laughs> and Slavko's still in the lead. Dushin's still in second. 
Wow. Wow. Bishop B4. Wow. Whoa. <laughs> what? Oh. Oh. Wow. wow. And he sees it, too. It's, it's happening. I love it. Thanks for alerting me, Marty. Wow. That's beautiful. It's a beautiful move. And soul loves beauty. And enjoying life. Yeah, he's going to play it. No doubt. He is not going to play Bishop B5. He could play King B7. But yeah, he'll see that. Wow. It solves all his problems. Wow. Wow. And then we have a draw. Or, or does, does Black win that? Maybe Black is winning. I still think White's a little he didn't better. Do it. He played, oh, really? Really, Yuri? He'll play Bishop no, B4 in the next one. Stockish likes this. this. King B7. Look at that. This is ridiculous. Rook E8. Rook A8. I'm going to go with Rook E8. Uh, wait, Rook. Oh, wait. Yeah, Bishop yeah. takes Rook. What the hell? What? Yeah. Yeah. Um, Stockfish, again, drug test for Stockfish. Why? Well, he just let him play Bishop Takes Rook? Yeah, of course. A horse is a horse. No, a uh, horse uh, is a cow. What uh, are you thinking? Now, is he going to like move the king back and forth like a duck in a shooting gallery with King C7, or is he going to push the C-pawn? Yeah. There you go. I was going to put that in. the duck in the shooting gallery. Enough. Eight people were Duck first, then ask the question. Yeah, I couldn't decide again. So wow, now we're now we're in draw city. Although, oh no, no, he is gonna do this. Oh my god, he's Rick A eight Bishop B four. Oh my god, he's gonna play it the second time like he did with Rick takes D four. Yuri, are you laughing at us today? I hope you're having a great time. It's because I made the diving joke. Yeah, yeah, Yuri's making fun of me now. I don't blame you, Marie Gary. Yeah. Rook A8, Bishop B4, Uniski. Wait, maybe Uniski doesn't want to draw this, though. But the, it doesn't draw. Wow, what's going on here? Yes, here it comes. All right. Yes, really? right now, live and in color. Go solo. Go solo. Solo is a good tactician, too. Come on, man. In fact, that's almost boxed now, isn't it? Oh, you can play Rick Takes Pawn, too. Like, that ain't happening. I thought Oh, so. you come on. Seriously? I'm, yeah. I'm disappointed. Yeah. Okay, we need to get these guys in the post game. They do great analysis together. And I want to know why you didn't do that. Because I don't understand at all. At all. Why would you... Is he, is he satisfied with the draw? Really? 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 Ah, uh, it was going to get interesting. Then push C3, Yuri. Yeah, push the pawn. No, he wants a draw. And now I'm buried. I just lost like zillions of crowns. And that orchid passed me. Good Bravo, oh, Orkin. Yeah. I had to take a chance, Orkin. Seriously, this is boring. You've been exterminated. <laughs> yeah, that's right, Buddy Orkin, man. Yeah. <sighs> okay. Yuri's going to get some messages from me tonight. Like, dude, oh, my God. It is. Oh, my God. Bravo, Savko. We had a really exciting position we had a fight break out, and it turned into a, a sleepover party. Wow. Really? Uh, Dusha Malojevic, $39.99. Congratulations. Edgar Rivas, $26.83. Matsu Leon, twenty five forty seven. And just to rub salt into my wounds, the fifth place prize, rather than what I had it in my pocket, goes to Orkin Abdullah. Bravo, Orkin, and to all our winners. And Marty, do we have anybody to join us here? We are trying. Because right, I want to know why he didn't play Bishop B4. See if they will join us. He's sacking the exchange, pseudo sack, and then for draw? Did he not look deeper? Oh, my goodness. 
Oh, I know Yanishki saw it. That's why he took Oh, it hello. Hey. Hello, Yuri. How are you? Who do we yeah. have? Yuri. Oh. Bravo it's, for no, it takes a D4. Uh, I'm, I'm, there. Now it's both. Hi, how are you? Hello. Oh, it's, um, fine. It was an interesting game, I think. Yeah, Yuri, why didn't you play Bishop B4 instead of the repetition? Yeah, well, Bishop B4 is very interesting. I don't know if... Okay, if... I right? did not feel I am any better here and uh, uh, decided that uh, draw is a decent result, especially uh, yeah. so in the uh, match uh, system. So with respect for Yuniski, I, I can dig that. Yeah, but... But this would have been an interesting game instead of it being over. <laughs> yeah, maybe, maybe. Yeah, but but here even root c one. I, I don't know if uh, if okay if black is better here. Yeah, I have no idea what's going on here, and I wanted to find out. So you guys got to tell us now. Yeah, maybe, maybe black is a little better, but there is some maybe it's a draw position uh, draw position here. Rick. Yes, this or I don't know. If, yes, because if d5, you can take an a3. And yeah. um, a6 pawn is very. Okay, I can take. Yeah, before. Uh, yeah. Here, bishop could be better than uh, the knight. Yeah, a little so, better, but I have a lot of choice to. Yes, of course. Make the draw here, and we are short in time. Oh, yeah. Yeah, five minutes. Uh, but okay, this and also okay. I'm not, not sure about uh, okay, rook h8, okay. and uh, even if I uh, sacrifice a, a later knight uh, for c pawn, but take all the king side, uh, it will be true. Yeah, um, and my h pawn can be uh, uh, I don't know. Zeros, yes, yeah, 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 I don't know. I would love to have seen you guys play it out. Yeah, I maybe. much uh, much more uh, prefer uh, to uh, provoke Yuneski to play uh, Rook D5 instead of uh, repetition. Oh yeah, yeah, and I was wondering if he was going to do that, but I don't think Yuneski. Uh... Then uh, after Bishop C6 and Bishop A3, I uh, unpin my uh, Bishop, uh, take on A3, and uh, with two Bishops and very strong passers, Black should be better there. Yeah, I think maybe you are completely. I don't know if winning, but your wow. position here. It's very awkward for me because your two bishops are very strong. Yes, and the bishop takes on a3. So yeah, and the c4 pawn. Okay. Um, yeah, maybe. I didn't think maybe it's gonna be a queen. Him. That that I like that. Maybe you play something better instead of king d7. King d7. Yeah. Yes, it's play for draw. Maybe something else. But I think I I completely. Oh yeah, yeah I, play, I play very passive in this position. I think maybe Bishop F4 was a best best choice for me here. Agreed. But okay, I take C4. I think this is a, a mistake because I miss Castle Long Castle. Yeah, yeah, everybody uh, did. Yeah, Long, long, long Castle <laughs> is a nice move. <laughs> yeah, um, yes, you're, so you're just better just in there. Bishop. Uh, then all my strategy was uh, then was uh, on the light squares at uh, rook d5, bishop a4, king d7. All this move uh, we are light squares because bishop is yeah. upset. Yeah, in the game I think that you can take, but but then and uh, maybe if this is not good for you because rook e1. I don't know if here. Oh, yeah. Here, but okay, the computer said uh, bishop c5 here. I don't. So it is. Wow. But anyway, bishop f4 is a, a better. Yeah, I, I, I would I would play, uh, play bishop c5 if you, if you play bishop f4 because uh, yes, I have to uh, complete my development. Yeah. Yeah, bishop c5 and the complete the position is uh, is equal. Yeah, yeah. probably. Bad props yeah. to both you guys well, so for a fascinating, five. adventurous game. For real, you guys really uh, took us yeah, way yeah. out of book. This was a very nice move for you, Queen F A five. Yeah, very important move I think in the in the opening and in the game because here I can go for the for the long castle and I can go for for the attack here. I need to play each of the three. I don't see anything 
another better move than this bitch of D3. Uh, what uh, does computer say about this position? Yeah, rook d1, I saw this, but uh, I don't uh, make any sense to play rook d1 for me. Uh, rook d1 is not so. Yeah, it's not so human. No, no, not, not look so dangerous. It's a bit yeah. artificial. Yeah, bishop d3, I think, was kind of interesting because I can play f4 sometime and then go for the for the short castle. But and maybe f4 immediately. F four. Yeah, I was wondering about that. Yeah, oh. but I saw before here. Um, yeah, hammer time. Uh, I'm not sure here. I e two and take an e three. <laughs> but can here I, you can take with rook. May I please ask a, a question yeah. about preparation? Yeah, and uh, then maybe queen c seven. Even here, I I don't know if I'm. Better here, queen c7. And if I play, uh, <coughs> if I play the same d5s and d5, probably, yeah. No, it takes d5. No, yeah, even, even I can, okay, the computer said I can take here. Yeah, because yes. maybe I play bishop okay, actually, I, I, I don't like uh, before. It, uh, um, uh, became some problems for me. I think maybe Bishop E7 uh, just to prepare a castle in uh, case uh, we exchange queens. Of course, with queens on board, uh, castle short uh, could be dangerous, but uh, maybe um, l later. But uh, now just to uh, complete development. Yeah, yeah, Bishop E7. Is hey, Yuri, um, I, I admire you as probably the guy on this site that prepares more than anybody. And and I'm I'm a bit fascinated because Unisky has been going to the uh, buffet every week with his um, Karras attack against the Skavenigan. So I'm wondering how much preparation you put into your opening today. Uh, well, uh, I uh, maybe uh, some people uh, who predicted moves uh, today uh, uh, noticed that I already played uh, this position several times. Uh, at, 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 uh, I, I played uh, this uh, I a6 and bishop d7 idea. Yeah. Uh, avoiding early knight e7. Yeah. Uh, Black's, Black's idea is uh, to push uh, b5 uh, on uh, queen side uh, first, and then, depending of situation, uh, play knight e7 uh, later. Well, bravo for putting the brakes on uh, Uniski's uh, Karras attack uh, for the first time in a long time. Uniski's been doing really great. So that, that was fascinating to me, how you were going to come to the table today. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uniski's like had a smile on his face every contest when he's white. Have you not, Uniski? For a while. Yeah, I, I, I like to go, I, to yeah. go for attacking Sicilian. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, I like the Sicilian as white and as black, too. Yeah, yeah. Well, both of you guys are fantastic players. And um, as great as you are as players, I think your, your analysis afterwards is always uh, breathtaking. Seriously, you guys are fascinating. And you answer every question, which is great for our audience. Thank you. Yes, thank, thank you. you very much, uh, both of you, for uh, playing a very interesting game, all very lively, and uh, look forward to the rematch, which will be tomorrow. Yeah, I love both of you guys. Thank you. And I love Michael, you too, Marty. Thanks yes, for yes, all See you all guys tomorrow. Yeah. Thank you. Yes, thanks. Uh, and we have, don't forget, we have both English and Spanish now in the live video commentary on the ongoing U.S. Championships broadcast. You can see all the games, and everyone. If you, as soon as you choose a game, you have immediately strong computer analysis that has already been computed. Will be displayed for that game, and will be updated on an ongoing basis. And we have a fantastic time odds tournament coming up in less, little less than an hour. Yeah. So we look forward again to the rematch, and we thank you all for attending, and we'll see you next time. Yeah, real gentlemen today. Uh, Thanks, look forward guys. to the tournament coming up soon. And uh, the U.S. Championship, which continues this afternoon.
Good night, everyone. Thank you. So long for the moment. We're going to sign off. Bye-bye from High Life. Bye-bye.